Nolan Alexander here with Brandon Reed. And Brandon, what led you to Georgia Tech from Arkansas State? Uh, just the proximity from home. Uh, I'm about 30 minutes away from Powder Springs, Georgia. Um, the academics, you know, the uh, prestigious uh, academics they have here. And just knowing that, that when I get that degree that, you know, I can basically go anywhere I want almost. And uh, that was pretty tempting and something I couldn't pass up. And also playing in ACC, grew up watching, you know, Georgia Tech basketball. And I'm very excited to be here and now I'm here. So that was one of the main reasons that I chose to come here as well. Who is your closest teammate on the team? My closest teammate would probably be Camion Hosey. Um, Went through a lot of battles. I met him when I was about 14, playing for the George Star, the AU program. And also in high school, from ninth grade to 12th grade, we had battles playing against each other in high school. And you know, I went to Whitfield Academy, he went to Hancock Central, and we both class A powerhouses. And it, it was just a lot of fun, and we, we grew a friendship from, from there, and then just carried on ever since I stepped foot on campus here. Where can we find you on an off day from basketball? You can probably catch me in my room. Uh, I don't really, I really don't do too much. Um, I can say my life is pretty boring besides basketball, but uh, you catch me in my room playing video games or just in another teammate's room, just trying to catch up with them and, and converse with them. So, Do you have any hidden talents? Well, <laughs> musical talents, I can, uh, I can rap a little bit. Um, I don't. I don't take it that serious, but I can't do it uh, when I put my mind to it. Uh, I think I'm very creative. Uh, a lot of people tell me I'm pretty decent, so um, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> <laughs> What's it like being the middle of five children in your family? Uh, early on, it was kind of tough, you know, uh, just having so many people in the house. and You know, you, you think you're not getting that much attention, but, you know, I was the middle child, so I could pretty much get away with a lot of stuff and just blame some things on my older brothers and, you know, beat up on the younger ones. So it was, it was kind of good uh, sometimes, but, you know, since I was an athlete, it was kind of strict. They were kind of more strict on me than others. So uh, it was, it was give and take. i say it was, it was both positive and negative to it. But, you know, you live and you learn. And uh, also just having older brothers, you know, uh, going outside playing with them, like uh, they're being like three to four years older than me. And uh, it just got me tough, you know, uh, getting banged up with the older guys and would be out there on the court all the time. And I think that just, uh, that's really a positive for me. It, it, it's still toughness in me, so. Does your family have any holiday traditions? Uh, <laughs> I'll say for Christmas, we get up, uh, we get up around 6 a.m. on Christmas day because my little brothers and they, they can't wait to open their presents so they'll wake up everybody else and we'll just end up opening presents at 6 a.m. and then we have a a big uh, family dinner where you know my grandparents and uh, aunties and then they would all come over and we all have this big breakfast every year so uh, I think that's pretty much it for our tradition. What's the best Christmas gift you ever received? Best Christmas gift I ever received? Ooh. I have to go back some years. Um, man I can't even think right now probably probably just knowing that my family's there it's probably like right now, you know, just I'm not too concerned about receiving gifts anymore. It's more about me giving gifts and uh, just being around family. But you know, uh, when I was younger, it was all about the gifts. And I'll probably say when I first got my PlayStation PlayStation console, I think that was the happiest I've ever been. And I was stuck in my room for days. You would never see me because I was in there playing the video games. So I think that was probably the best Christmas. What's the uh, favorite movie you have seen this year? I'm not really a movie person. Um, I would probably say my favorite movie is watching ESPN. Uh, my parents would say you know, I'm always watching ESPN or watching some type of basketball. Um, I don't really watch movies too much um, or anything like that. But if I am watching TV, it would probably be something funny on TV like Family Guy or just watching sports or just watching uh, – True TV, so I like watching things like that, like Criminal Minds or something like that. So um, I'm really into that stuff. So that's what I'm probably watching more so than watching a movie. 